very pleased to have uh, come here for the first time to Cyprus and to be greeted by the President. Uh, but I obviously are here because I think that I've been campaigning for and I will continue to campaign with uh, the government as it's changed now to make sure that we have all of those British citizens of Turkish Cypriot origin who have huge families in London and also here to be able to get to and from without having a terrible difficult time uh, being unable to get a direct flight. So it's very important for us to for humanitarian reasons, make sure that British citizens do have access to their families in the easiest way possible. Right Honourable Ian Duncan Smith for his visit to North Cyprus and to our presidency. Life goes on and obviously it, it, we owe it to our community, we owe it to our youth, we owe it to our future generations that we will do our best to find uh, the right settlement on equality terms, on sovereign equality terms, and obviously until that date I am demanding from the international community and from friends like you that at least direct flights, direct trade and embargoes on our sports and other uh, way of life should be lifted. As promised 20 years ago in the Annan Plan where the international community uh, looked at our face and said look so long as you say yes to the Annan Plan no matter what the Greeks would say we will make sure that embargoes are lifted from the Turkish Cypriot so that you at least have the opportunity to prosper economically. Unfortunately, that promise hasn't been kept and we are still um, under embargoes and isolation in this day and age. Therefore, I very much appreciate your visit. I appreciate very much your interest in our affairs and uh, I would like to keep in touch with you. Thank you very much. Very good. We will indeed. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very good to see you. Thank you.